Ladies and gentlemen, GTC 2016, I'm so excited about the work that we're doing together. The air is electric, the environment here, the researchers, all the amazing work that you guys are gonna do. We announced five things. The NVIDIA SDK, iRay VR, Tesla P100, NVIDIA DGX1 in autonomous cars, HD mapping, and then of course, AI driving. Now let's talk about VR. VR is not just a new gadget. Just as your cell phone is not a new gadget, it's a brand new computing platform. Today, during the show, we're going to take you to some places that you probably only dreamed of. The first of that experience is Everest. Incredible, incredible recreation of Mars. Taking dozens of satellite flybys, we've meticulously reconstructed the surface using photogrammetry. Eight square kilometers of the Mars surface has been recreated. Why don't you go ahead and try it? Tell us how it is. Well. Am I, on, am I on Everest after global warming? Is that it? Realistic is not enough. It's got to be real. So ladies and gentlemen, today we're announcing iRay VR. Nobody would think that it's possible. This is actually a stunt that I didn't think was possible. I mean, this is no different than Pixar rendering their film and an entire supercomputer is used to compute each and every frame meticulously. This is no different. Here we're creating a scene, we're creating a room, but we have to create it in real time. ImageNet, Microsoft and Google, using deep learning techniques, was able to recognize images better than a human for the very first time. A single algorithm was able to perceive the world better than any human. Physicists said that it will take another 100 years for a computer to master Go because the computational complexity of Go is practically infinite. It's practically infinite. And yet, this year, using deep learning algorithm, Demis and his team created AlphaGo and took on the best living player of Go. Ladies and gentlemen, I can tell you, Pascal P100, it is in volume production today. I am so freaking excited about it. Are you allowed to say that on stage? John Kelly said this is a new era of computing. Jan LeCun says, we need more GPU, more memory, more bandwidth, and Pascal is the ticket. The densest computing node ever made, 3,200 watts, eight GPUs. We have quad InfiniBand. Connected together, this is one beast of a machine. 170 teraflop machine, the densest computer ever made. Brian Catazzaro is researcher at Baidu. He was formerly one of NVIDIA's greatest researchers. You're my hero. I just want to tell you that. I hope it doesn't embarrass you. Well, I am thoroughly embarrassed at this point. <laughs> Pascal uh, is going to really help out. Uh, not only is each GPU much bigger and much faster, which we, we really need, but the interconnect between GPUs is much better and also has new capabilities that we're going to use for interesting things. Ladies and gentlemen, Roger Manga. First of all, congratulations on TensorFlow. Thank you. My goodness, I mean, you guys literally launched this just several weeks ago, and it's just swept through the industry. Like you said, deep learning is a really big thing. Uh, we really believe in it. We really think that that is the future, right? It's going to be part of every single thing. It's the world's first deep learning car computing platform. We call that car computer the NVIDIA Drive PX. AI will be used inside the car. AI will be used to drive the car. AI will be used to keep you out of harm's way. We believe AI will be used across the board in car computers. These are the pioneers of AI, and we have chosen them to be the first recipients of the first DGX1s that come off the line. We want to make sure that the future of AI continues to run at the speed of light. I'm also super happy today to announce something very special, that NVIDIA is the founding technology partner of MGH's Center of Clinical Data Sciences. As you know, Mass General is the US's leading research hospital. Using DGX1 and using deep learning, their scientists, our engineers, are gonna to work together to advance medicine. And what better application for deep learning than to improve our health, improve life. Thank you guys, have a great GTC 2016.